Thanks for stopping in. A little web weather extra tonight. I want to talk about a couple of things. We're getting into Christmas weekend. We'll spend a little more time uh, talking about how that weather may impact uh, your travel plans for the weekend. Also want to point out we have had some great sunset pictures in today, and I do appreciate those uh, sent in through WKBN.com. Also through our Storm Team 27 app, and those come directly in. Hey, don't forget, uh, this is a great picture of Mosquito Lake, uh, but notice how the picture is narrow. Make sure you take your phone and you turn it up on its side uh, so we can get that big picture as you said in those reported pictures, but I appreciate them uh, coming on in. I had some great sunset pictures here across the region this evening. Now you can send those in right here where you're watching on WKBN.com. It's really easy to do or report it. Uh, if you haven't done it before, you just fill in a little bit of information and send that on in. Let's go ahead and talk about our weather. Now, at least temperatures are warming up a little for us, and they have been. We're melting off a little of that snow and those ice chunks across the area. But as we get into tonight, I am expecting these temperatures to fall uh, once again back below freezing. I'm also watching another storm system to our northwest. It's uh, bringing a little bit of snow our way. Now, this snow is going to battle a lot of dry air, uh, but it could lay a blanket of snow down across parts of the area into tomorrow morning and then through the day tomorrow still that risk of snow showers for us. But I'm going to go ahead and uh, fast forward into the Christmas weekend because Friday is looking dry. A little bit of light snow tomorrow, but Friday looking dry. So we'll go ahead and race on through future tracker get you through tonight. Here comes that snow for tomorrow morning. As we go through the day tomorrow, uh, just some light snow showers around uh, could see a dusting possibly up to a half inch. I think total accumulation at the most less than an inch uh, across parts of the area. Uh, again, just a, a really struggling to get through that dry air tomorrow. Pretty weak system for us now Friday. We stay dry. I'm looking for some sunshine around as we go through the afternoon. The clouds will build back in, but I want to take you into Friday night because maybe you are traveling for this weekend as we get deeper into Friday, especially after nine and 10 o'clock. Watch what happens. Here's a look at nine o'clock Friday night on Future Tracker and the next storm system finally coming together. You know, I've been watching these all week and uh, the two longer range models I was looking at just couldn't quite come into agreement how this system was going to impact the area for the weekend. Well, here's the way it's looking now. Things are starting to mold together. Uh, looks like we'll get into a, a wintry mix here. Friday night on into Saturday morning. There's a look at midnight. You see a lot of colors on there and the pink, the white, the green. Uh, that's that wintry mix coming together. And again, could see some rain or snow showers around. I'm not expecting extremely heavy precipitation and even a small chance for a pocket of freezing rain or sleet. Friday night into early Saturday morning. Now, as we approach early Saturday, I'll back this up here toward about seven o'clock Saturday, uh, temperatures will keep climbing. So as they come up, we're going to see this wintry mix change over to rain. Now, the good news for your Christmas Eve is it looks like this precipitation will move out of here by midday, and then we're going to dry out as we go into our Christmas Eve night and on into Sunday morning and the temperatures keep climbing. So unfortunately, not a great chance to see a white Christmas across the area. Number one, our temperatures are going up. Number two, of course, uh, we're going to add a little rain on top of that. Now the rain showers do return late Sunday on into Sunday night and especially Monday. Look at Monday's high 55 degrees scattered rain showers around even a small chance for some thunder on Monday and then we'll settle things back down on into next Tuesday and Wednesday with highs in the mid 30s chance of snow showers around on Tuesday. So our temperature is definitely on the upward swing as we go on into our Christmas weekend and that's uh, unfortunate if you're looking for that white Christmas, but a small chance of a little snow into tomorrow that won't stick around long though as we continue to warm these temperatures up into your Christmas weekend. So that's a sneak peek at uh, what I'm looking at here over the next seven days. It's kind of an upward forecast for us, but uh, the trickiest part of this one will definitely be Friday night into Saturday morning when we have that chance for a wintry mix. Thanks for stopping in tonight for our little weather web extra for us this evening and uh, I will keep trying to do these as we get deeper into the winter explaining what I'm looking at here from the Weather Center.